Happy blessed Cinco de Mayo to all. Cinco de Mayo is one of my favorite days of the year. I jokingly tell my daughters and others that I feel like I'm part Mexican. They usually laugh because they know that my nationality is not Hispanic. Cinco de Mayo reminds me of the day that God protected me during a robbery by speaking audibly to me. Out of that robbery, a wonderful friendship was formed. I was a young minister at the time. I used to live in Los Angeles, California. I loved to shop in a city outside of Los Angeles called Southgate. I went into a dress shop there and tried on several dresses. The dressing room had a white louvered door that faced the front door but was in the back of the store. The store also had mirrors that went all around the store up to the ceiling. When I had finished trying on the dresses and was about to leave that dressing room, I heard a loud booming voice in my ears that said, don't go out of that door. I stood still again. I heard, don't go out of that door. I knew it was the Lord and I said, why? Then I said, Lord, can I at least peep out and see what's going on? I opened the door just the tiniest bit and looked out and there was a man at the register with a gun robbing the store. I also looked up into the mirrors and saw there was another man who was at the front of the store acting as a lookout. I eased that door closed and stepped back and waited until they had left. When they did, the cashier as well as myself was shaken by what had happened. We hugged and called the police. The cashier's name is Nancy Rodriguez. She is Mexican. We became great friends. She invited me to her church, which was called Templo La Hermosa, Church of the Beautiful One. The pastor, when he learned that I was a minister, invited me to minister there at the Spanish church two times a week. They became like family to me, and I learned so much of the Mexican culture. My family and I joined the church, and even some of my friends joined. I ministered there for several years, and one of my favorite times of the year was on Cinco de Mayo. It always reminds me of how God protected me by speaking audibly to me during that robbery.